what's going on y'all so welcome back to my channel and if you are new welcome to my channel and today I am at the planetarium the new planetarium here in Miami and it just opened I believe like the 2nd of May and I'm really trying to hurry up before it starts to pour down raining because it is coming a lot faster coming down a lot faster so let's see where do we go to get to the main entrance Ooh. I think we go this way. Is it this way? Yeah, it is this way. Okay, so I'm trying to walk and I try to get out today early as possible because the weather has been like terrible. Terrible, 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 terrible weather. You can see these huge rain puddles everywhere. It sucks. And I'm kind of nervous because I parked so far away because it was cheaper, of course. It always happens like that. And um, I hope it is not pouring <laughs> when I get back, when I get back um, out because that's, I didn't bring my umbrella. So y'all pray for me. Pray for me. I really hope this is correct because I think this is okay yeah look at these horrible clouds and I need to hurry up because as you can see it's it's renting we are here something but does our brain interpret something else or does it try to interpret what we are seeing basically that makes sense I think I just like spoke in like kind of like an infinity sign <laughs> but anyways this is pretty cool I can't wait to see what I'm going to see next um it's a lot different and I think I assumed it was going to be but let's see what's next so basically right now this camera right here is picking up everything that it says what I think I see and it's so crazy because it's so accurate so these robot arms just drew me that's one of my photos and here is the other Looks just like me, huh? <laughs> and here are some others. These look much more accurate to the face of the possible person that they drew than mine does me. And we got a signature. <laughs> Basically, where the three dots are, they're capturing his eye movement and initiating it on the screen. was 
about like optical illusions I think and I'm sorry that I did not get to show y'all the robots drawing me two out of the three robots were working and it took about 15 to 20 minutes it didn't seem that long but I'm sorry I did not get to film that if I had somebody here hoping to, to be able to hold my camera I might have would have I probably should have just prop my phone up on a little shelf or something like that and filmed it but I'm sorry on to the next feathers to the stars so in here I believe they are going to basically be comparing the prehistoric life of dinosaurs to the planes and things that we have today as far as aviation and flying goes. to the stars to the aquarium to be honest you guys I wasn't quite interested in that by any means and just compared a lot of the bugs and birds that we have today to aviation like I said before and it wasn't interesting
Now for a couple of nights, need to rebuild myself to come alive. It all makes sense now, now that the lights out. It's a different world to me, it makes me feel down. Wait until the storm comes out. Until the sleep comes, I miss it all. place of science and history history and science I enjoy myself here very very much so glad I finally decided to come visit this morning it wasn't too packed because now the lines are getting a tad bit longer than they were before this morning and the Sun is bright it's not rainy yay um, <laughs> I'm super happy it ain't rainy y'all cuz I probably would have been spending some more time in there while the rain stopped it is so super hot super sunny and while I walk back to my car I hope it does not rain on my head next door clearly we have like <clears throat> I guess it's like another museum oh, it's actually an art museum really not interested in seeing that today so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog haven't done a little daily vlog in a little while so Hope y'all enjoyed it. Hopefully my next adventure will be a tad bit more adventurous and it won't consist of me being inside but outside in this beautiful heat and sunny weather in Miami. Until next time, bye, see y'all later.